very rare exclusive build. Built, uh, this particular one was uh, built by Sorensen. This was his uh, personal sailing yacht. He uh, cruised her around the world and then wound up in Florida where its uh, present owners bought her and have uh, owned her for a few years. And they have done uh, lots of updates themselves. Got a full Dodger, it's in decent shape. Let me jump on board here. You can see something is unusual right from the get-go. Tells you that this is not a mass production type of, uh, I'll get more on, more on that later. Here's your nice glass and a Dodger. That's a pretty, pretty decent shape, a little bit cloudy, but not too bad. It's a light raft, teak deck, teak decking uh, throughout. I don't know if you're uh, worried about the cosmetics on your teak deck, you could uh, always get this uh, varnished and, and finished up at your choosing. Nice thing about this uh, center cockpit design, but it's very, uh, this, the way that uh, the cabin trunk is integrated into the foredeck, it's kind of tapered, so it's, uh, deck accessible up here. Real nice design. All the uh, rigging was updated in 2015, including a new Selden mast. Aluminum mast. There you go. So, so that's all nice. Everything is all the hardware uh, appears to be in uh, good running condition and uh, ready to sail as are all your uh, lines and halyards, sheets. They look pretty decent as well. Okay, so here's your uh, cockpit. And again, you can tell that this is uh, kept nice and covered. All the uh, benches and uh, teak in here is in good shape. Got a big wheel. Uh, the electronics were updated in 2015 as well. You got a big Garmin up here, top side. You got one down at the nav desk below. Autopilot's been refurbished. You've got, uh, I don't have these on, but you've got uh, wind and speed as well. There's all your engine controls. You got hours there. I've got hours on the listing, nav tech, hydraulic system, big uh, Umar winches, self tailing, and you've got all the lines leading back into the cockpit. It's a fractional rig, so uh, light crew or uh, I don't know if you can single hand with something this big but uh, definitely get away with a light crew helping you out let's go down below and here we are down in the cabin uh, very lavish use of uh, cherry veneer teak throughout Beautiful, uh, beautiful full galley with freezer, stove, there's a microwave up here. I got all that in the photos, double sink. All of these windows in here were replaced mid uh, 2019 and uh, as well as some of the cherry veneer that uh, where the windows were leaking a little bit, leaked in and messed up the, the wood veneer. That's all been, uh, repaired and replaced as well. So everything in here is uh, looking beautiful and ship shape. Lots of storage in here, uh, lots of conveniences. Uh, for instance, you got, uh, you even have a washer and dryer, combo washer and dryer unit right there, which is nice. 
Uh, got your aft stateroom, your AC controls there. Uh, it's a one zone AC, but it uh, keeps the whole boat cool according to the cellar. The engine room's in there. I've got the photos of that. Uh, you got more, more storage and uh, lots of, uh, you know, lots of wood, cedar line storage in here. You even got a nice, uh, nice uh, bar in here. Bar cat bar with uh, liquor storage cabinet. That's nice. Storage in there. Uh, here's your uh, navigation station and there you go. That's what I was talking about. So there is, <laughs> that is a prism. So there's probably, I think, uh, four or six of these prisms around. You can see it's pretty, pretty light in here. So there's one in the galley. There's one uh, in the head up here. Uh, so those harken back to uh, an earlier time for sure. But it does lend itself to uh, brightening up the, the cabin which is nice. You got a uh, nice headroom. I'm uh, six foot. I've got a couple inches of uh, headroom. My head's not bumping into anything. Uh, nice ceiling on here as well. So nothing, uh, nothing wrong with that. No, uh, no apparent uh, leaks or water damage coming in through there. Um, got your nice uh, salon area here. Uh, forward, we've got a forward stateroom with its own separate head. And uh, each head has its own separate shower stall. So that is a uh, nice benefit. That's a nice bright, uh, you know, that's a big big berth up there. Big double berth. And again, I, you've got uh, all of your uh, cabinets and storage and everything else there. And you even got a nice big storage area here. All these latches and hatches work see that so everything works there the salon has a uh, ice maker working ice maker raritan ice maker that's a nice feature so ice maker and washer and dryer combo already that's uh, something you're not going to see on a lot of uh, 40 40 plus foot uh, cruisers back here here's the uh, master stateroom this is nice and bright back here lots of uh, big salon or big uh, windows and uh, portholes here so you don't need uh, you don't need those uh, prisms back here for sure uh, nice big vanity area right there that's in all the photos 